handoff to now. Thompson trying to look for that three, but you see, I'd rather have that ball inside, trying to get some to Topkins more touches. Thompson went inside, and Booth came out of the phone booth. It is the Case Cavaliers in town, and they are leading this one 19 9, 250 remaining. Ball now through Zwirling. Brown squares up for three. Bottom of the net. And that's at least 12 points from the perimeter early for Casey. And that's something the Cavaliers have put into practice here. They lead by 13. Brown with Bishop. Long two. And that is good. Stuff as the... Uh, <laughs> yes. Geez, that's a word we haven't used. Well, it's a word we can use. We haven't. As Brown goes to work by herself, has support. That is Abby Bishop. And that's the bottom of the net. Second hustle plays by Casey. And, uh, and what we call a one percenters is really helping helping them in this quarter. Absolutely. Long shot by Brown. Bottom of the net. Yeah. Perimeter obviously shooting the lights out so far, wanting to maintain that, or a bit of a change up as we see Conti inside. Yeah, look, I think a little bit more penetration there, hoping will open up the shots as we see there from Lou Brown. So the Casey are in control. Brown, 15 footer off glass, no good. Second opportunities, no one boxing out. Look like they're running with you know, very small ball at the, at the uh, guard position, but the forwards and talls, and there's that run by Gilliam. Up and under, big basket there. Pass now to Conti, who's had a nice game to Booth, who's down the floor, wants to give and go to Brown. Easy as you like, and one transition, Casey basketball. If the girls can knock down a few shots, get this little crowd here to get, get vocal, this might change the game a little bit. And again, everyone contributing so far for Casey. is Brown again on the boards, and one! Monique Conti from the car park wasn't able to get that one. Hit by a pedestrian. Brown again, big rebound. Making 18 points, 11 rebounds. Player of the game so far.